To test the manifold air pressure sensor, the MAP sensor, on this engine, you have to remove the manifold, which I've done here, and it's mounted this position here by a single 10 mil bolt. This is where it goes through. Here is the actual sensor. So I've inserted a plastic tube on the end in order to test it. Uh, I've got a probe on the signal wire from the sensor, which is the right hand wire here. The other two are zero ground and five volts. You might want to test that those uh, are existing, that it's getting power. Uh, you have to have the ignition on, of course. With it just sensing the air pressure, the reading is about 1.77, 1.76 volts. And we can test it versus this graph that I made up, shown here, which comes from the rough bit of data that I found on the internet from one of the sensor suppliers, Hella. Translating that into a straight line linear graph gives us a graph of PSI versus voltage reading. So we can check whether our sensor is reading correctly by putting on a pressure gauge. I've limited the pressure to 15 PSI, which is should be around the maximum that these things sense. That's above atmospheric pressure, of course. Uh, if you just put a tube on and blow on it, you should be able to get the voltage to go up to about two volts. You uh, suck on the tube, you can get it down to about uh, half a volt or so with a good hard suck. Well, nearly 0.6 of a volt. A bit more precisely, if we use a pressure gauge to pump it up to 15 psi, and here you see we've got about 3.8 volts and about roughly about 15 or so, maybe 16 psi. Certainly giving a reading in roughly the right sort of ballpark. Uh, we can cut it down to maybe 10 psi, 2.8. So should be roughly right I believe and we can use that voltage output to give us a an idea of how much boost we're getting inside the manifold which might help diagnosing it does seem that the sensor is working at this stage I'm going to solder a little wire onto here permanently so you can probe it while it's back in place and measure the boost pressure and that's how to test your manifold air pressure sensor thanks for watching bye